What's going on YouTube? Geosnow right here. Today's video is going to be a quick PSA or public service announcement for those of you who are waiting for the jailbreak on iOS 15. This video is brought to you by KeePass, a program by Starsoft which allows you to unlock the iPhone on the activation lock if it's an iPhone 10 or lower or any iPhone on the lock screen if you forgot your passcode. This works with both Mac OS and Windows and you can definitely check it out in the link below. So we have important and bad news today. The iOS 15.3 RC is no longer signed. Apple stopped signing it today. What this means? It means that you can no longer downgrade to it and it also means that you can no longer save the blobs for it. The only signed versions right now are the iOS 15.4 release and the 15.4 RC, both of which are pretty bad for jailbreak purposes. Remember for the iOS 15.3.1 and lower, including for the 15.3 RC, we have a kernel vulnerability already released by Synective and there is a proof of concept already available, so that one can theoretically be used for Torin in the future or even for Uncover. Though, by the way, we don't know anything about Uncover for the moment. A lot of you are asking me what's going on with Uncover, if we know anything about any iOS 15 update. There is no news, Pound Own hasn't posted anything, hasn't talked about anything, so we don't know whether this will be updated or not, but Torin is definitely getting updated. Coolstar even posted some progress a couple of days ago, back on March 27th. They posted here, quote, iOS 15.0 to 15.1.1 demo broke out of the sandbox and execute commands already signed on A13. I've been making jailbreak since iOS 11 and A12 iOS 15 has been way more difficult than anything I've seen before. 15.1.1 is gonna be my last, that is, if we can hook Amphid on A12. So it appears that Torin is definitely getting progress towards iOS 15, however, Coolstart said that this update will be their last. Now, whether or not they're going to use Synactive's bug on A11 and lower to update it to iOS 15.3.1 and lower because that's compatible I don't know, but they are definitely going to release the jailbreak for 15.1.1, but there seems to be still problems on A12 plus because of Amphid and stuff like that. So definitely be patient. iOS 15 seems to be very complicated jailbreak and as such requires a lot of time to jailbreak and of course a lot of effort. But yeah, iOS 15.3 RC is no longer signed. If you were planning to downgrade to it with future restore or to save blobs, it's now no longer possible. So now anything you do, do not update to 15.4 because starting today, there is no way back. So that's basically it. Thank you for watching. I am Geosnow. Till the next time, subscribe to stay updated and peace out.